Hey guys, what's going on? Tribor here. Today we're going to be playing some more Farming Simulator 2017 on the No Creek Farms map. And today we got a little stuff to do. A little bit of stuff to do. Not a whole lot. Uh, we did get all the corn sold, I do believe. I went ahead and sold it all. Yep, it's all gone. And I went ahead and all the fields that we bought, I went ahead and plowed them real quick just so that all of that is done and which field should we buy should we buy 18 15 or 11 or should we not buy any of them I kinda wanna buy 18 just cause it's cool to get back there you have to drive across this field and back through there and 15 is kinda out in the open 11 same so yeah I did get all these plowed um so now we were gonna cultivate them but I don't think we'll cultivate a lot I mean, there's really no need to cultivate the ground. Fertilizer states, we got two on the wheat. We will have to spray the wheat pretty soon. We'll have to spray everything at least once. Um. So yeah, and we're gonna buy the interrogator. This will be one of the things, and then we're gonna sell the other one. It's only four hundred eighty dollars. It's pretty cheap. Only bought it for a thousand, so and then the sprayers, I'm not gonna buy a sprayer just yet because a lot of people wanted different stuff. A few people want the brute, a few want the case, and some want the rogator, and some want the massey. So I'm gonna put a little card up here that'll should have popped up at the beginning of the video or close, asking you which sprayer you want. So this is the brute, this is the Patriot. And I will have the other Patriot. All of the extreme is this little sprayer. It's a pretty good sprayer. And then obviously the Rogator, I'll have it there. And the Massey Ferguson sprayer. And I think that's pretty much it for now. Oh, and we have to move this blue mixer machine. We should be able to sell it here in the shop. I think I just passed it. Nope. Where's that? There it is. 55,000. We'll go ahead and move that in the placeables category here. There we go. Now I'd like to put it kind of like I'd love to put it over here somewhere. I don't know. This is all open over here so I think what I'm going to do is I think the driveway is right here so I'm going to put it right here. Um, right there. I don't know, that looks far, far out. I feel like that's out in the middle of nowhere. Actually, I think we're going to put it right there. I think that will work good. Then it'll be out of the way. We should probably f put some hay in there. We should actually buy some quick. So that we can fill that up. I think that's what we'll do right now. Actually, we need to get the interrogator home. Where's it at? There we go. There's the good old interrogator. I need to make the wheels a little wider. Not a whole lot. Um, and I need to make the footprint on the tracks. Like right here. Where's it at? So like the track right there. It needs to be a little wider. Actually a good amount wider. Um, I'm going to have Artist Jack do that I think in a little while. I think I'll just send it to him. Or he'll be able to tell me how to do it because they are kind of small right now. And then once we get them widened out, it'll be pretty cool. I do got to do some lights. I might have him do the lights. We'll see. I'm pretty sure he knows how to do lights. I do have hazards, but they're squares. And I looked in all the things and it's replaced. But I'll let him mess with it for a little while. If he can do it, that's great. I don't usually use lights anyway. So it's not really a big deal for me. We're going to go ahead and fill this all the way up to the top. Uh, we're going to cover all the ground except for the wheat. And there's this solid. So yeah, we'll fill this up. We're going to go spread field 27 real quick. Actually, we'll go to spread 12. So while this is filling, we're going to go ahead and buy some hay. We don't have any grass, so... Actually, we already have hay. We need straw. Straw bales. We'll actually have the priced ones here. 
Oh, well, I'm broke. So, I guess we'll buy the $0. I don't even know if you can. We do have silage. Let's buy... Straw bales. We'll buy two sets of them. And we'll buy a set of... Regulars. 11 tons. And the old fertilizer spreader. It does pile it up. And I do have to have him fix the camera because when you speed up and you get up to full speed or somewhere in there, it just, you just can't see. So this is actually what the interior looks like. Um, it's actually pretty sweet. So if we can get that fixed, it'd be awesome. Um, I'll probably send it to him or ask him about it or have him do it. And if he can't, that'll be alright because 19 is just around the corner and I'll do all that converting stuff in 19. So let's see, we might as well take this out of the field, try it out. I'm going to go ahead and go down to field 12, just because it's a pretty good field. It's really cool to get to it. Have to go across some stuff and all that. So anyway, I'll see you guys when I get to the driveway. Alright, so we're rolling up here. By the way, it does go 55 mile an hour. And yeah, so this is our little entrance to this field. It's pretty sweet, I like it. I like this map for its entrances like this. You have to go through the trees and all that, and then there's ditches everywhere. So yeah, we'll kick this on, we'll get it going. It does have a pretty good sized footprint. I think it's like 22 meters, somewhere around there. We might as well slap this up. 36? 6. Maybe I was thinking of something else. But yeah, this is 36 meters. Um, it works alright, actually. It works pretty good. Other than this footprint, the tracks are kind of small. The tires look like really small on it, I don't know why. I think it's just scaled down that much. I need to just take it and widen it out a lot, just in general. So yeah, this is kind of a goofy field. There's like a little nook right there, and then there's like one back here, and it's kind of crazy. And then... So yeah, we're going to hopefully get to planting too at the end of this episode. I don't know if we will or not. Um, that might be for next episodes. But we do got to get pivots in. That'll be upcoming. Um, we are going to be using the new planter and the new air drill. I guess we already drilled wheat with it. But we'll be using them. Um, we'll be planting corn. All that kind of fun stuff is coming up. I'll probably just run course play make a video on planting it and then that'll be it instead of like what I did with plowing and do it off camera that's yeah so I'll probably do that or maybe even stream it on my channel I might do that we'll see I'm not sure that yeah I might stream it on my channel if you guys want to go check it out links down below to it it's like the third or fourth or first link I don't remember and the link right after that is the one to my discord server so if you do want to play in one of my live streams on my channel or even maybe possibly a stream on this channel you'll be able to play um, when I let everybody know and or you could just not be in a video and play also I do that once in a while if people don't have a lot of mods I'll do that not very often but once in a while so yeah, we don't really use GPS much in this, so we'll probably shut it off. There's really no need to. But yeah, this interrogator, it's pretty stinking sweet. I converted it over. Actually, somebody else did. Converted it. And I downloaded it. It didn't work, so I thought, oh, I'll find it. Because I knew it was converted, because that's what they said. It was from 15. And so I converted it, tried it. It didn't work. I had to put the the spray animation on the back or the spreader animations and if you hire a worker it just drains the tank empty I still gotta fix that like I said do the lights and the camera and the person's all jacked up in here so it's not fully ready to be released yet um I don't I'll probably release it I don't know when whenever I get it fixed up and we'll have to see if artist jack wants to do that if he does I'll probably end up releasing it and I'd like to put a logo on the side of it. I'd like to do a lot of things with it, but we'll see how it turns out. I'd like to put like the logo on the side of the box or something. Make it mine. 
And I think in 19 I'm going to convert a lot of mods also. Just the ones we already have, put it to 19. If it's not too hard, like I said, if it's like really tough to do and I don't understand how to do it, I probably won't. But I'm pretty sure it'll be just the same as this year. I'll just copy over the lights, files, and the, all the other crazy stuff you gotta do. Usually Giants Editor does it pretty much for you. Um, the lights this year are whack, so... Hopefully it'll be easy, or somewhat simple, like this year would be nice. If it stayed the same, but it probably won't, there'll be some more... I'm guessing shop features to it. I wish there was mud on this map. It'd be cool if I could make that ditch just full of mud. Make it splash and everything. You can see my tracks are kind of like really small. We're almost done with this field. I'm going to go ahead and finish the it up real quick. It shouldn't take me very long at all. And we'll go ahead and get into that. Alright, so we got that done. The other thing I do have to do to this interrogator is that I have to make it use a little bit more fertilizer. I only use 5%. That's really not a lot. I'm going to take it to the next field and then probably make a stream on my channel. Float and dry on. This bridge is out. I'm going to go around it. And it does slide around a lot too. And it does do that a lot too. And I don't think I have Nope, I don't. So I guess that'll have to sit there for a while. That's alright. Uh, let's see. What do we gotta do now? Um, actually, let's get... Oh, shoot. Oh, we'll start this up. We'll back it up. I think we're gonna try and put all the hay. Let's see. Can I get there? Let's open this door up. We'll get in there, turn the wheel, let it spin out, hook the trailer on. I think we're going to put all this hay in the mixer, and then we'll, we have to go pick up some hay with the semi, and once we get that all picked up, I think we can just shoot it out the back. This will probably get it full, I would guess. Pretty close. Actually, I don't even know. Let's go ahead and do this real quick. Get this little bit that we missed. Circle around like such. We'll have to unload it like curved like this so that it shoots it into there. Keep going. There we go. Ah, oh, shoot. I guess we can just throw it in. That'll be alright. There we go. Turn it like so. Rip all the axles out from under it. Shoot, I missed it. Well, let's try and back this up. These hay wagons, if you could back them up, you could be awesome. I can do it, but I don't have the time right now, so I'm not. There, now we should be able to just throw these. I don't have my hand, that's because I have HUD hydro on, that's why. That sucks. Oh, I guess that works too. Pick it up. Come on. Just guessing where the hand is. Shoot it over. Perfect. So we are going to need a little bit more. I'm just going to leave this hay wagon out in the open. Along with the tractor, they can sit out for a little while. This one can stay in. Mm, let's see. It's my floater that's flipped over. We have our tractor in here. Semi that thing there's the old semi so I'm gonna try to get this out of here actually I'm just gonna yeah cuz I don't want to move it actually it's just gonna glitch through awesome alright so that was pretty easy to do we'll go ahead and take this this is our new hay holland semi let's go ahead and load these up Oh, there it goes. It's going. I don't know why it won't take those though. 
They're just taking them. Oh, I don't know how they fell in like that. But I guess that's how it is. We'll get these two back here, or this one back here. And then we'll go put all these in the mixer. Then we'll pull out, go get the load of straw we bought. Stack it somewhere out in this open area. There we go. Oh, and hit that thing once again. It's my break on this semi. Just a corner of everything. There we go. Oh, where's this button? I gotta hit V and I gotta hit Y. And all the hay goes everywhere and it's probably full now. Well. Should be in work position now, maybe. No, it is. Oh, almost hit the other post. Not quite. I like using a semi with this because you can turn like a really short. We also do have a little bit of snow left over from where I pushed it up. And once we get all these stacked, I think I'll unload them close to there. Just put them out in the open. Those deals almost, oh boy. There they go. So yeah, everything needs maintenance too. We should probably do that. I think we'll just dump them off this side actually. Or in the back. Dump them off in the back, about in the middle. There we go. Oh, we still have one on it. I think it'll ride. So we'll take this 40 foot trailer. And our little tiny semi. Go get some hay real quick. Alright, so we're arriving here. I'm at our destination. We'll swing in. I don't know, did I put it? Yep, it's in works, work position. I'm gonna go ahead and buy another hay. Or another straw thing so that we have straw. There we go. We'll get that when we drive out. It'll turn pretty short. We'll have to swing wide on this. I went the wrong way. Oh, that might not be so bad. Go close to the ditch. Oh yeah, I made it easy. Now I gotta swing over here. Should be able to make that pretty easy too. And we'll head back to the farm. You can see the farm right there actually. We'll get this all loaded up. Or actually unloaded. Probably just unload it on the flatbed. Do we have straps on here? I don't think we do. Whoa, you can move it up and down. Wait. That's cool. Oh wow, we even made that. Sweet. Just move it up and down, huh? Oh. Oh, sweet. You can move it around. I didn't know that. Awesome. I'm going to put it all the way out there. And we won't even have to pull in anywhere. We could just drive unloaded on the road. Be cool. Alright, I'll put it in regular position. There, now it should be old as you hit Y. Actually, that one. They're going to go everywhere again. There. It's full. And actually, if I think we just go like this. Crank it. Oh, none of them are falling off. It's all loaded on one side, so they all should just fly off at once. Maybe not. Jackknife it. What the world? There, that'll do it. Let's knock them all off like that. There we go. Ramp the snow pile. Have a little fun. I don't know how we'd get it stuck. It's a good thing we didn't. We'll just unload these. They're all mixed up. Let's just mix them all up some more. Ramp the snow pile again. Get it stuck. I guess we didn't get it stuck. I'm surprised. And then... 
I'm gonna hit this just so that I can get all the bales off of it. If any will fly off. Two did. Might as well hit it again. I don't I know I don't want to hit it straight. There, one more was on there. Sweet. Did it get in the pile? Oh, killed it again. I need to get this thing serviced. That's what I need to do. Man, they keep going under. What in the world? Oh, because the thing's full. I'm smart. Alright, well, we'll dump it off the back, I guess. Kick it in the auto load position. Attempt to auto load these up. If I can get the one out from underneath the trailer. Maybe, maybe not. I think I'll just hit this snow pile. How rough is it? Oh boy. We're gonna get it stuck this time. Oh, no. Keeps on going. Oh, killed it again. Crap. Come on, semi. Uh oh, it ain't loading. What the world? Work position. Um. Hmm, maybe it's in. Okay, now it's in work position. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Loading the other ones. Yeah, probably should have just. There it goes. Back it up next to this one. Drop them off. We'll park this up next to the other one. Because we probably won't put it away in the shed. Because we don't need to. So I'm going to leave a lot of equipment out. Just because we don't have a lot of storage room. And it's a lot easier just to jump in something and go. Rather than trying to dig it out. Let's see. What else? Oh, we do have skids here. Forgot about that. With a loader on it. Instead of auto load. What do we got to do? Um, actually, I think we'll just call it good here. Oh, wait. I know what we got to do. That's why I wanted to know where the loader's at. Because. I can. Load the hay into the mixer. And unrealistic as possible. I'm the best unrealisticer ever. Might as well kick on auto load, cause I'm realistic. Alright. Drive over here at twelve mile an hour, burning four gallon in the hour. Math questions. I'm not gonna do. Let's see. Actually, we already filled it. We need silage. What am I doing? That's what I need. Silage. Well, might as well just park this skid steer right here. And we need to go get the auger. So we'll get in the old 4020. We need to get that new 4020. The squad's got the uh, year-round cab. That thing is awesome. I think I'll get it actually. So where is the auger? It's back here. Actually, it's all the way back there. It's still set up, I'm pretty sure. Unless we grab that one. Actually, they need to make a conveyor belt. That's what they need to do. There's already one in the game, but. Let's drive through the fan. There it is. 40 20 year round cab. I need to get that thing. There we go, we'll just drive it. Fire it. Lift it up like so. Oh, we still need steering wheels. There we go, now we can lift it up like so. Probably can hook it on from there, no, can't. There we go, off to the races we go. Oh, it's probably gonna fill full of snow. Maybe not, yep, there goes the snow. Oh shoot, I activated the thing. There we go. Get the mixer full. And it filled full of snow again. 
Oh yeah. I don't even need the auger. Man. All I need is a semi right here. I forgot. That's all in the uh the big thing in the jig. Whatever you wanna call it. See now it's really easy to get straight with this and get it loaded. Get the old silage out of the bin here. That's what I'm gonna call it. Wood chip silage. Fill it up, it does fill pretty quick. Probably just do this. That's probably good. I'm gonna fill it up just because. And we'll get it unloaded. Swing around. Probably should have done a wider swing. Ooh. Probably can't unload it, imagine that. Actually, I probably should have moved it forward just a little more. Actually, there's no deal there, so I guess we might need the auger anyway. So that we can unload it into here. Because for some reason, it doesn't want to unload in the silage thingy in the jig. We'll pull all the way past, and then we'll back up. And still nothing. So, we'll set up the auger and get it to work here. So, if I can get in the 4020 again. Wherever that thing's at. There it is. Hey, it's full of shaft now. What a deal. So we'll get it. We'll get it unloaded. Drive it all over here. Ramp the snow pile again. Back it up there. Actually, let's drop it off right into the carriage. Run back here. So I'll unload it real quick. Uh, there we go. Wait, we have to do that. Put it up like this. Wait, hit on that thing. Unload here, pipe out. All right, so this should work. If not, I'll end it here. But it should work. Oh. There we go. Uh oh. Turn over here. Come on, Logger. Oh, well, that's taller. Let's drive it forward. Drive it back. Drive it forward. Oh, it just goes right to the semi. Cool. Yeah, I don't know why I want to work. I'll get it to work, get it full. Anyway, this will be the end of the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Did hit that like button. And we will see you all later.